You know, it's weird because I, the game ended, uh, I'm on the field, I remember Kelsey, I don't remember too many things about the game itself, I really don't. I remember Kelsey comes right up into my face, it was late in the game, and he's screaming at me, <laughs> not in the bed, like not, he was screaming at me and he's like, he's like, Nick is playing out of his mind, and I was like, yeah, let's keep it going. And he was just so, like, the juice and the energy that he had, it just was amazing. But I remember that moment, okay? Then I remember the game ended, and I was looking for my family, and I couldn't find them or see them anywhere, and I really wanted to celebrate with them because, you know, your family, I mean, they, they're really the ones that sacrifice. They, they are, move, I moved my daughter three times in high school. I mean, it's the sacrifice that your family goes through so I wanted to be with my family right at that time. I wanted them, and they eventually got to the field, and then we were all hugging. It was unbelievable. It was emotional. It was, uh, and then, <clears throat> the, you know, everything was going on, and then uh, I still was kind of like not realizing. I was just enjoying with my family at that moment. And then uh, we get in the locker room. Everybody's, you know, doing their thing. We get, I still never felt like, I guess the first minute I felt like, uh, we really did this was the parade. The parade brought, I mean, that was, we, we pulled out of that stadium. Uh, we were, la they, put, they put us on bus 12. I think there was a reason for that. I don't know, the offensive line was the last bus. <laughs> I don't know why they did that, but they did it. So we're pulling out of the stadium. We make the left heading towards Broad Street. No set, I mean, I'm not 50 yards out of the stadium. Jason Peters says, stop the bus. He's like George Washington standing in the front of the bus, you know, like going across to Delaware. He's, and he says, stop the bus. And the bus stop, dry, you know, the doors open. The entire offensive line, including myself, run off the bus. We, in, we were on the streets. We're grabbing people. We're hugging them. People are crying. We're crying. And we just go up the street like that. The bus kind of follows us. Then Kelsey jumps on a police bike and is driving around. And, and that's when I realized that, like, that was like, that was the, that was really when it kind of hit me, the whole thing, you know, and then uh, that was a great day to me. That was awesome. Speaking of Jason Pierce, what does it mean having him back this season? Obviously, he was instrumental behind the scenes, but I'm sure he wants the ability to go out winning on the field. Yeah, I think that I, anytime Jason Peters is, I mean, he's been around the whole time he was around, but to have him back on the field playing and watching that guy kick slide and run block and just watching. He's a special, special player. They're, those guys don't come around very often. So I just, I enjoy coaching him because he's a yes sir guy. I mean, he doesn't, doesn't matter. I can get, I can go right up and say, hey Jay, you know, you turned your foot around. He goes, and then he said, teach me, explain to me. He wants to be coached. I mean, like he has all the answers now. He, he, he really wants to be coached and he wants to, if I see something, I know him so well that if I see something out of the ordinary, he wants me to tell him. After you got hurt last year, after you got hurt last year, did you think you had coached him for the last time? No. You always believed he'd come back? Always believed. I will never, ever, like, I tell him all the time, I say, you know, I've been here for six seasons, going into my sixth year, and every year, everybody says, you're too old, can't play anymore. He just smiles at me. This man, I think he likes that. So keep doing it. I think he like, he, he's like, that's OK, fine. Because it's, it's, he just has this drive to him. Like even now, he's, I, it, that's actually more now than I've ever seen. He's like on a mission from God right now.